Why are you recording? Yeah. We're wearing a white t-shirt. A white shirt? Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I need some background, Mike. Oh, oh Jay, watch me out. Oh, you're right. In here. <laughs> I didn't. How? How would I buy that? Oh, look at that. Jingle bells. Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna kill you. Where are you? 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 At the harbour, it was just huge. Do you think it was amazing? It's dirty and smelly, and did you not see the human waste floating? God, we had to stop in the middle. It was so practical. All the small ships were there, and they had people to come up to get us. If we're in the big boats. Yes, but they charge us extra just because we're foreigners, and that's no. not right. No. And after, when we went to the Tower of London, wasn't that just amazing? Well, I didn't get to go to London because I was running away from the cop houses. I was trying to keep all my money, you see. I wonder why you went. I thought you just went to the loo. No, the loo's are infested with maggots, and you know, I can't get Well, after that, it was amazing. It was truly amazing to tell them. You just love it. Didn't see it, brother. Yeah. Why not? But, well, you have only your glasses half full. Do you want some? Oh, empty. Oh, yeah. But, what we all came for was the trade, wasn't it? It's was to me. Well... There was just so many choices. Yes, bad choices. Good. Uh, you could buy anything you wanted. No, no, all bad. Dirty. No, terrible. On the way, though, trade escape. I don't think that's a brilliant idea. That just was just disgusting. disgusting. No, no, let me speak, let me speak. You do not put heads on the poles on a, on a gate. It's just, no, it's but disgusting. It was... Full of discipline. No, no, that does not show someone's power. Anyway, that doesn't matter. But after when we crossed the Thames again to see the straight Shiberian play, wasn't that wasn't that great? Well, you, you were so squashed together you could hardly breathe. And then at the end, you get splashed in blood. I mean, so we, so we got a bit muddy and blood. But didn't you think it was just such a great atmosphere and such great play? Well. No. I've got a wide angle and it still doesn't get you in. <laughs> right. I have been recording for the last five minutes, so. Right, I'm going to go from this side. Close it and don't let anyone else in there. Stand on the door and stop the people coming in, okay? Ready? We're going for a take. Th quiet on the set. Three, two, one. Those in the background are sort of at a bar watching this unfold. Three, two, one, go. What do you think of the streets? Streets? Streets are dark, dangerous. What about street boys? They're really dangerous. Only if you meet them, you can just run away. You just don't want to meet them. They're there. Didn't we just love our day in London? What are you talking about? You know, it was horrible. For starters, the weather. It was raining and it was cold all day. Best in the beach in sun in Italy, now. I like the sun. There's nothing wrong with it. The view from the boat. Magnificent. All the houses and the busyness of the city. What view! Their houses cramped together with smoke and pollution and then oh, the smell, the stench. It's unbearable. Why did our friend that agrees to so happy? And when we walked through London Bridge with all the tightly packed houses and the, the, the way they crammed together, it was just so rural. You must be mad. The houses were crammed together. They were throwing human waste off of their houses into the gutter. It was so crowded that it was full of cop purses. I had to hold on to my purse the whole time. Did you see the gate with the heads? How great that shows people who enter the gate the discipline and the way that it was frightful who wants dead moldy cut off heads on the top of a gate it's unhygienic and it just looks terrible <sighs> just so ungrateful for places we go and those gutters getting here i mean you saw 
poo and all sorts, blood and it was just disgusting. And those carts and sheep going by, it was just terrible. This place is terrible. You are just a prince of Wales. Well, I thought it was a brilliant place. But coming into the city, going into the rip, coming from the river, it's brilliant seeing the whole sight of the whole city. But you've got London Tower, where probably some of our Italian brothers are being tortured. You have Traitor's Gate, where there are people's heads on spikes. How warm a welcome is that? But that's a brilliant way to show people that have been traitors. But they're talking about all the sheep. Let's talk about the Shakespearean theatre. Okay. What did you think about that? We were in big crowds and we had to hold our purses because of all the cut purses. But where we were, it was a fantastic view of the play and everyone around us was posh and polite. But then when they threw the uh, blood on, on you, you're covered. Well, it's a great look, way look for the audience off. to interact. Oh, and the theatre. I loved the show, it was amazing. Oh, I hated it when they all splattered blood all over the place. Ugh. That was disgusting. That was a bad thing that was a bit The bad thing was kind of expensive. And there were a lot of actions. Well, I don't like it anyway. You two are always complaining about everything, aren't you? There's nothing good enough for you two. True. Well, I thought the play of Nick Macbeth was really good. Well, you had to stand up for ages. I got so bored, and I don't like Shakespeare anyways. Italian plays are so much better. Yeah. And the, t and the tower, you could get a great view from there. Well, you know what? Maybe a good view, but if you look down, there was torches and buildings were made out of wood. So if one torch fell, they would all burn down and the city would burn. I'm sure one day London's going to burn down. Well, you're just an idiot, aren't you? And anyway, the people there hate foreigners. I mean, we weren't treated very well. But going through the bridge, it was what a nice story, wasn't it? The Traitor's Gate? Would you like your head stuck on a pole? For everyone to see? No. Of course. At the houses, the houses have been gutter in between them in the middle of the street. There's waste everywhere. I mean, they kill sheep and then they throw everything in the middle. The story was very nice. It was too complicated. Like, one person loves another person, then they sh kill the other person, then someone kills another person, and everyone ends unhappily. That's just not right. But this Shakespeare guy, they see that he's a new revolution for writing. 